Hi guys, welcome to my channel, Thelma's Creations and More. This video is to sh as a thank you to Tracy DeVilbliss for our Shabby Chic Embellishment Box over on Facebook group Swapper's Corner. Me and Tracy had a swap for a Shabby Chic Embellishment Box and guys, this is what she sent me. It is so cute. This is her box that she sent me. Look at the little ladybug. It's totally adorable. Look at that tag with a little sweet little Victorian girl. A doily. The rose. Look at the butterfly. Love butterflies, guys. And look at the little bike. This is how she decorated the outside of her box. She decorated one of these boxes from Dollar Tree. And I have to say, Tracy, it came damaged from the post office. The package was open and smushed and stuff. But it doesn't matter because it still um, does its uh, purpose. Holding little embellishment boxes in the post office, you know, smush the package. And look at all the things she put in here, guys. It's amazing what you can put in these little boxes, guys. She made me some bowl with some organza hot pink. Beautiful. Look at this one. The little polka dot like pink bow and then she oops i'm sorry she made this one out of leather cording i believe it's like felty but i believe it's leather it's beautiful she put me those there and look she put me some two little cute lavender blingy butterflies i just love my butterflies and then some cute little clothespins i love to alter clothespins so those will come in handy in pink, mint, green, and white. She put a little spool of ribbon. How cute is that? Sorry, my phone came out. Um, like It's like a shimmery lavender with white pom-pom trim. Very cute. Then she sent me some of these. They're like pendants for a chain. It has that. Look at that. I can't wait to see what I'm going to put in the middle here beautiful brass and then the silver pewter looking one beautiful thank you tracy and then she put some beautiful brads but look at how beautiful and detailed they are look at this uh, there we go a little bird beautiful this one's like a cameo with a blue background and i apologize guys i am i have my phone propped up with look at this one brass with a little flower cabochon beautiful i have my i have another setup for my videoing today um look at this little wood veneers and some wood veneer hearts uh yeah my ac broke down in my house and i am recording here in my um, living room so i had to make do look at the bling just check out this bling so i have my foam propped up with a cosmetic bag which is the black that you see on the bottom but you know what we're gonna make it work you know we gotta roll with the punches look at the altered piece a uh, puzzle piece she sent me she put love and then with a little flower that's beautiful and then she put this one to light pink and she painted that and oh i'm sorry she painted that with timeless and put the little white um rose on it cute I like those. those are nice and then you're not gonna believe this Tracy but I have been looking for these little mini popsicle sticks everywhere here because I want to do some summer embellishments and I needed this and you send me some and you send me washi samples on them which is cute because I love this idea because it's a double blessing I got some mini popsicle sticks and washi tape samples in this one Let's see. There we go. It has a little bicycles. Thank you so much. What crafter cannot use washi? I'm sorry. I'm one that loves it. Although I hear some people that don't like washi, but I'm not one of them. I love them. Look at this one. Very pretty. Very shabby chic. Like the mint green with the roses. Oh wow, there's some more. Look at this one. Has It's like a red background with the doilies on them very nice and I really like this idea of putting them on the mini popsicle sticks and then it's this one Let's see ooh look at this it's like oh uh, it has a doily and then the flower but look at the colors the mint green yellow hot pink blue 
love it for summer and then this is another type of bicycle one that's a very cute look like a teal very nice thank you so much for the popsicle sticks and the washi tape samples love that and then she sent me some of these flowers in the last compartment look at that beautiful beautiful flowers oh my goodness so that's what she put on the embellishment box but she went the extra mile let me put this back down here that way they all can stay oh it all can stay in here and I love it because it closes and who would ever tell that you could put all that stuff in one of these little hardware boxes from the Dollar Tree <coughs> excuse me so she went the extra mile and sent me some extra goodies and these are some small gold folder photo corners and there's eight of them look at that beautiful I love these. I'm going to start making junk journal. Um, and I'm going to so use that on there. Thank you so much. She sent me a sheet of these beautiful. Oh, they're punched. Creative memories. Uh, stickers. But I thought it was like. Um, you know, I thought it had a silver detail on it. It isn't. It's, it's, the sticker is actually punched. Very nice. Love it. Thank you. And then she sent me some chipboard tags. Look at that. I will definitely be using these in my journals. And then she sent me like an ephemera. Beautiful. Look at, ooh, it's still excited. Love that for one of my corners. And she sent me some shabby chic buttons. Look at that, they're like printed on there. Very pretty, thank you, Tracy. And then she sent me some some embellishments that she made me let me see she sent me two of these oh they're the uh, mason jars and she put two of them together and so they're kind of puffy like they have dimension to them and then she put the little twine on them how cute thank you Tracy she sent me two of these vellum tags beautiful with a twine and then a cute little small, the smallest doily I've ever seen. Very cute. I like that doily. I love doilies also. They're so many things you can do with them. And then she sent me another bag of embellishments that she made. Look at this. It's a circle punch, ribbon, a button, and some flowers. Look at that. That's beautiful. as a tuck spot. And then look at this rosette. It has a button on top of a... Oh, it's an enamel dot, I'm sorry, on the top of a button, on top of the rosette that I think it's a paper or maybe she drew on it. It kind of looks like it's sewn on the paper. See that? And then on the backing here, it's actually some flower parts. I have never seen that and it adds so much texture to the rosette. Thank you for that idea. And then she made, oh, this way. She made these embellishments, a paper cutout, and then look at the butterfly. I love butterflies, guys. And look, a big butterfly, a smaller one. She layered it on top so it has dimension. They're stacked and kind of folded. And then a cute little paper bowl. Very nice. Thank you, Tracy. Look at this. Another one of those cutouts, punch outs, I guess. And then um, a layered flower, a stacked flower with a uh, brad and then she um she um put it in the back here and then glued it on top beautiful oh wow look at this one fancy but fancy simple and shabby chic at the same time so this is a die cut and she glued it in the back of an organza pink ribbon bow and then a little piece of applique beautiful tracy i like that i love embellishments homemade embellishments or handmade anything and look the flower parts on one of the same little punch outs the flower that she took apart and put here and then she put like a little sticker of a rose and look at that embellishment very unique has texture beautiful Tracy just beautiful and again look at the the way she used the paper um, punch in the background 
And then she put this burlap flower on it with an enamel dot on top. So look, she used her paper punch so many ways. One, two, three, four ways. So that's beautiful. Thank you, Tracy. I love it. I love to see people's um, work on their embellishments because, you know, she took one paper punch and she had four different ways of using it. One, two, three, and four. Beautiful. You will never tell that that one's in the back. And look, so she took what she had and made it different by putting different elements. So thank you, Tracy. I really enjoyed everything you sent me. It was so cute. had a lot of details. And um, thank you. I will be using your ideas of your handmade embellishments when I make my own embellishments. I love it. Look at this. Just beautiful. Thank you so much, Tracy. I really enjoyed our swap. And maybe in the future we can have another one. Thank you. Bye, guys.